this weekend will be two years for me. When do you get used to it? When do you get institutionalized? I mean, I wake up every day, I look at my wife. Don't you got to go home? My mother's coming over here to clean. You got to get out of here. You know, I'm Italian. She's scared. All right, this is a comedian Goomba Johnny talking about marriage and growing up Italian. Yeah, absolutely. And look, he's here live in studio. What do you know? There he is, Goomba Johnny. Everybody here in the studio, give him a round of applause. Yay! All six of you. you there here. it is. There Thank it is. You. Thank you for that forced applause. Absolutely. Not true. No, no, no. Hey, it's, it's so cool that you're able to come up here. I know you're from New York, born and raised in the Bronx. Uh, I, I know. You know what it's like growing up in an Italian family. So, so what was it like for you? Loud, probably. Well, yeah. I mean, you, well, you learn to be loud because you have to compete for like attention. Attention, yeah. yeah. Everybody. Uh, but uh, I grew up in the Bronx, and it was a four-story walk-up, and uh, there were four apartments on each floor. And uh, out of the 16 apartments in the building, uh, I think seven were my relatives. Really? Huh. Yeah. So every everybody's a cousin, so you had cousins, right? Cousins, right? Uh, Everywhere. Uncles, all my uncles. My, my, we had my father had six brothers and one sister. So yeah. everybody lived in the same building. I would come home from Catholic school. I would walk up each floor. Every door would be open, and they would say, "Johnny boy, Johnny boy, come here. I want you to taste this." <laughs> and by, we lived on the top. <laughs> by the time I got to the top, I was filled with gravy and crumbs. Yeah. And my so mother, it's gravy, not sauce. <laughs> yeah, I, I, you know what? I, I don't get. <laughs> what I, to say. I, I, don't, I don't get in that. I never engaged in that argument. But okay. in my house, we said gravy. Okay. Now I, I've learned. Uh, my girlfriend's Italian, and the first time I we went to her grandma's house for Sunday dinner, mm. I ate my pasta. And I'm sitting there being all polite. Oh, thanks. And she's looking at me. She's like. Aren't you gonna have another bowl of pasta? Like it's you're like yeah. offending them if if you don't have a second. I mean, food is big, right? I mean, yeah. your whole life wraps around food. Food. And Italian household. You're a true food. Yeah, you for sure. And and one of the things when you're in a really Italian household, uh, we used to eat the salad last. It's true. <laughs> you know, and it's like dessert. I, I had my first girlfriend over, and she thought we were done eating. My mother brought out the salad. <laughs> 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 She's like, what's this? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> See, that's I, like, of course. Wait for dessert. Palate cleanser, I guess. So, so this is cool because you're going to be performing uh, coming up this weekend, and also we have like a, a big star there. I, I know from one of the forget Teresa's about a comedy shows. show, right? Yeah. It's forget about a comedy, and the, the show is starring myself, uh, Regina DeChico, who is one of the top Italian. Uh, female comedians in the country. Mm -hmm. She's very, very funny. Uh, you're going to be hearing a lot about her. Nice. Uh, and Vincent Pastore, who, who is from Soprano fame. Right. And uh, we do something very, very different. Uh, Regina will come out and open up the show, then I'll come out and I'll do 40 minutes. And then I'll introduce Vinny and we do like a 10 minute stick. Mm -hmm. And then Vinny and I develop something. Uh, it's called interactive comedy. And it's not done anywhere else. Where Vinny is a legitimate acting coach, he works at HB Studios in New York, and he's directed and wrote plays. He's starred in Bullets on Broadway with Woody Allen. Yeah. So he's very, very accomplished. So what he does is, everybody in the audience, everybody in the world has seen The Sopranos and they know the characters. Yeah. So Vinny will invite people on stage who aspire or have aspired to be actors, <laughs> and he has them act out scenes from The Sopranos. What? Wow, that's with, great. With him there? With him there. He directs it. So in other words, he'll bring you up, yeah. and he'll say, all right, you're Tony Soprano. Oh, jeez. All right. Yeah, I'd be a bad Tony. <laughs> well, <laughs> I don't well, think, well, that's you know. where it gets funny. Right, 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 right. <laughs> And he'll bring her up, and he'll say, look, she owes you $25,000. Oh, jeez. I want to, I, go ahead. Should we try it? And he'll go, action. And then you'll say, uh -oh. you'll say to her, can okay. I have my money, please? And he'll go, cut. Okay. That's not the way Tony <laughs> Soprano would say it. You want to try You're it? You're not breaking any legs or arms. Y you sure? Go for it. All right. Hey, uh, you, you owe me some nope. lunch money? No. <laughs> that ain't quite not a chance. <laughs> now you can see how funny right, it can no, be. No. So Absolutely. it's really, really funny. And what uh, is it like working with him, though, being on stage? I mean, you're trying, those are like big shoes to fill if you're playing the role of somebody who's in the show. Um, it, well, it, it works because you don't have to explain the characters to anybody. Yeah. I mean, you everybody knows who Tony is or Uncle Junior or Bobby Bacala or even, you know, Vinny's character or yeah. Carmelo or you know, whatever. Yeah. And so it's really, really funny. And we've traveled all around the country. We've done casinos everywhere. That's and so people cool. have been very receptive to it. Nice. In fact, this is our second time at Treehouse uh, Comedy in Westport. Uh, we sold out the last time, and uh, there are some tickets available. We expect to uh, sell out again. Nice. Well, let's go. do it. Let's what a show it's going to be happening Saturday, August 25th. There you see it. The Forget About a Comedy Show.
Goomba Johnny, this is fun. Great no, you, to have you here. You know, we expect the both of you. This or is what? Or what's going to happen? Uh -oh. <laughs> Watch out. Maybe nothing to you. Help us, Brad. Help us. All right. Well, well we got to work hey, on our acting. Okay, I'll, he's I'll, he's I'll, got a problem. I'll work on it. Stay with us. We'll be right back. <laughs>